Hi guys, this is me. Um, quick sub, you know, this has been a while since I did a video blog, and it's actually, uh, what is it? The date is, I don't even know what date, okay, it's the 28th of March. I say it's been a while since, you know, I've done a video blog, and so, you know, but, you know, nothing much has changed. I've been staying busy working, actually been real busy working. Uh, at the shop, we're actually getting a lot of business, and so staying busy, which is good, making money. But, um, that's about, you know, pretty much. I think them about the same old, same old. Um, they've got a fresh one of the interesting projects. One of the interesting projects I'm working on is actually um, my cousin Justin actually got married over the weekend. So him and he married uh, our good friend Kat, and they they got they got married. And and I said I was actually in the wedding. I was actually the best man. But um, my dad went and we actually videotaped the whole thing. So I'm actually working on that project. Actually editing the video. And um, you know, with with that, what makes that project so neat is I've done weddings before. But with, in, in the past, I've actually when I when I videotape weddings, I actually used a digital camcorder. So which, you know, digital camcorder actually saves digital the digital images the images on a on a a tape, a magnetic tape. You know, like a, I thought I had one here. You know, about just a regular magnetic tape. You know, like any other camcorder does. But with this one, we didn't actually use that type of camcorder. We used, uh, my dad has a digital, an Nikon digital still still camera, but it also does a video mode. So, and it actually saves video and pictures on an SD memory card. And I use that, and my, uh, my I, also, I also have an iPad. I use it to shoot some video too. So, so it's the first really video project I actually used it, where we don't actually use a camera that uses tape actually uses memory memory cards. And I think you know I've done video blogs before that. In fact, this video blog is actually being shot on my Android tablet, you know, which saves it on the memory card too. But this is the first time I did a big project. So this is a wedding actually on a, a, a camera that saves to a memory card. So, so it's pretty neat. And I'm so speaking, I was just talking about my, uh, my iPad. Yeah, I actually got an iPad. It's so pretty neat. And if, you, know, you see here. But the anime is pretty neat. And I said I still got my Android tablet, which is which is what I'm using to shoot this video. And I said, you know, they're pretty good. Um, the difference in them is, um, well, the size is one thing. But the iPad actually, it seems to run a lot smoother. You know, I still use my Android tablet, and um, because it's easier to share stuff with. If you go shoot a video or you take a picture, you just put the Android tablet up to the computer, and it's easier to copy it. Whereas the iPad, you have to use iTunes, and sometimes it can be tricky to make transfer, especially to take pictures off. off of it. But, um, but it's actually an iPad is actually a better, better, a better tablet. So if you, if you got one, you know what I'm talking about. Um, and of course, I've got a, I've also had an iPhone, and I've had an iPod before, and I've got a Mac. So I, you know, I, I really like Apple products; they're pretty easy to use, and and all that. You know, you know I've actually. For Christmas, I've got the, the biography about Steve Jobs, you know, the founder of Apple, or co founder of Apple. And it's a pretty good book. I've um, been reading it, which I've kind of reading about 30 minutes a day, but I've kind of got towards the end of it. And this has been so busy, I ain't had a chance to finish it. Of course, it's all sitting in, and it's at a point where he's, where he's starting to get sick, so I'm kind of like, well, if I want to, you know, it might be depressing, so I'm kind of, but I'm going to finish reading it though. But, and, and, and the book's pretty neat though. You know, it starts out when he was young and goes all the way to the time he recently passed away. Um, but it's a pretty good book. Um, one of the neat things about it was, you know, Apple made the, the uh, which they had computers for years, you know, but they made the iPod, and then they made the iPhone, and then they made the iPad. Well, so reading the book, you realize they actually started working on the, I, the iPad before they worked on the iPhone. Um, that basically, Bill Gates was, he, I mean, not Bill Gates, Steve Jobs was meeting with, he had a meeting with Bill Gates and some other Microsoft people, and the Microsoft people was talking about, they were working on a tablet computer, and so, you know, that's when Steve Jobs got the idea that Apple needed to make a, a tablet computer, and so he went back the next day and had Apple, at Apple and had them set up a, a team to start working on a, a tablet computer, and a touch screen tablet computer. And they were working on it a few months later, and they, were all, they actually were going to meet, and they were all complaining about their cell phones, and they, they switched the focus to a phone. 
and brought in the people that's been working on the touchscreen tablet, work on the touchscreen phone. And it's, that's why the iPhone came out first. That's pretty neat. Um, you know, you know just, you know, technology amazes me. And, you know, especially as I'm in the computer field. And one of the things that that really gets me is, um, you know, I'll go online and I'll get magazines in that talk about this new technology, you know, and you look at it. But, you know, just like the iPad, for example, I remember seeing years ago on, on Star Trek. You see a little crewman walking around with a little tablet typing away, and, and they'll walk up to the captain, and the captain will look at it, and he'll type something on it, you know, and they hand it back to him, you know, call it signing paperwork or something. But folks have it the future, they had them on Star Trek, and now we have them in real life, you know, it's pretty neat. Um, there's all kind of amazing technology, like there's, like I said, like private companies are building spacecrafts and rockets, and, and it's pretty amazing, you know, that one day, you know, here soon, you know, we're going to be in. It'd be almost like the sci-fi movies, you have all these, you know, computer technology, and you'd be able to, you know, excellent, you know, just like on movies, and you have spacecraft, you'll travel to different places in, it, in a solar system, so it'd be pretty neat. But, you know, and I go and I look at all this, all this amazing technology they're making, and then I go online, <laughs> someone like Facebook, or turn on the news, and you see people fighting back and forth, and killing, and you are kind of like, wait a minute, it kind of upsets you, because here you are, you see all this technology, the future looks bright, you can turn on news or go online and people are arguing and you're kind of like, wait a minute, you know, are we really advancing or not? And, you know, and that's kind of like, that's what I kind of look, you know, like with you know, all the sci-fi movies, the more reason I'm excited about technology. It's in all the sci-fi movies, you know, the world is this great place in the future and people don't fight and, you know, there's no war and it's, you know, a perfect thing. And technology brought everybody together. And... You know, so, you know, and that's the way I believe, you know, we have a few technology to bring the world closer together and people realize that, you know, we're all the same. And it's already happened because, you know, I've got friends on online from other countries and, and get talking to them and, you know, everybody's the same. And so that's, you know, and that's, that's why I feel essential that, you know, technology, but when you go on and you see the people talking, just talking, jumping back and forth to one another and arguing and, how mean people are to one another, and you realize, you know, is this feature going to happen or not, you know, but, you know, the truth is, people's got to want to change, and, and that's the key, I guess, so, you know, we should use that to try to get people, you know, you know just try to do our part, change, you know, try to become a better person, so that one day, you know, change in our attitude and with technology, maybe one day we could have a, you know, better world, you know, so, that's, that's what I believe, but, um, that's pretty much it um, for this blog, and I already had to get all my rant, rantlings, my rant, rantings, but yeah, I said I'm doing all kind of neat stuff here every day, at shop, and work on computers, but I guess you can say. But um, anyway, so, you know, I'll try to start doing blogs more regularly, so you can, you know, check more. I'll talk about more different projects I'm working on, different things I'm working on. But, but anyway, so until next time, have a good day.